I'm so excited that we are launching our guest speaker series that will come out once a month um, on a Thursday and I'm just here to introduce what that is. This first uh, month of October our guest speaker is someone that I adore a lot. He's actually my husband. Tyler will be talking uh, about life and what it's like to be a young adult in the business world. He has a kind of cool job and he'll describe that to you and how to also bring your faith into uh, into work life. And so I hope that these speakers will give you life. They'll give you energy and strength by what they have to tell you. Uh, Tyler really has a heart for other men in our community. And so he leads a men's small group weekly and he's just pretty awesome. And so I hope that you enjoy this guest, uh, this guest speaker for October. And if you would like to be a guest speaker, please let me know because I always like to share uh, regular stories with everybody around us and to just build our community and build each other up. And so I hope this blesses you. I hope to see you soon. And let me know if you need anything at all, if you'd like to be a guest in our speaker series, if you have comments about our weekly devotion that comes out, or if you ha have ideas on how we should get together. So many blessings to each of you and we'll see you soon. Hello everybody, my name is Tyler Lentz. I currently work for Caliber Homes. I project manage specifically for the RH series custom and spec homes. A little interesting fact about myself besides being married to Pastor Ashley Lentz is uh, I swam at Iowa and, and competed in the 2012 Olympic trials. Uh, I swam the 200 and 400 individual medley uh, an incredible experience that uh, I'll forever be grateful to be a part of. A little bit about my faith. I grew up going to church on Sunday and Wednesdays uh, with family and friends. And uh, probably wasn't until about my senior year in college where I really started to ask questions and wanting to dive deeper uh, to fill a gap in my heart that just needed to be filled up. And... I've noticed since, and luckily that's where I met Ashley uh, too, but I've noticed God work every day in my life uh, since I since I started asking questions and diving deeper into relationship. It's been pretty awesome to see every day what he's doing, uh, whether it's with family, friends, or in the church. Uh, he's always on the move, and there's always something he's working on. Even when you think it's the smallest thing, uh, it's pretty neat to see. To those young adults kind of wondering about faith, life, and work, I think there's a there's a kind of a piece from Joshua 1.9 uh, where he says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. And I think that's a good reminder with those three principles of faith, life, and work. There's going to be struggles. There's going to be times where we're down, where we we need help, uh, where we're trying to chase something and it's just not coming. And it's good a reminder that God will be with us no matter what we're doing, no matter where we're going. God is with us. And he's the one that makes us stronger and more courageous. And I think that's a good reminder as you continue to build a relationship uh, with him. You can put your trust in him and um, and he loves you. And, and that's, that's all you need. Kind of final thoughts as a little about life as a young adult and shining God's light. There's a, there's a ton of darkness and I think... Uh, during this time, it's easy to get caught up in it. Uh, but one one reminder, and I lead a uh, small group of men, and we talk about chasing things that don't give us any any feeling of um, fullness. And whether it's money, chasing cars, chasing a better house, chasing a better job, chasing whatever it may be 
you find yourself getting to that step and wondering, okay, what's next? And we talk a lot about in our group about chasing the wind. You're chasing the wind. You're just going to keep going and nothing's going to feel great. And you're always going to want more and you're going to want more and you're going to want more. And I think um, instead of chasing the wind, you chase God. You turn to God and you ask him, you ask him your questions. You ask him your tough questions. Uh, ask him whatever you want. And I think continuing to ask questions to, to God gives us the ability to really shine our light in this dark world and show um, show those around us who he really is. Uh, and that's, that's impactful and, and um, certainly will make a difference. So... It was great to meet you. Great to uh, great to be able to talk with you uh, today about um, just God's faith, what He does in our work and life, um, and, and always know that He's there for us.